another thing I forgot to mention is my Nana was worried that I'd be too old for like a little DIY bag, but I love it. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome and welcome back to my channel. My name is Madison Page and let's just jump into the video. Wishing you all a very Merry Christmas for the final time last year. <laughs> Today is the 1st of January, so Happy New Year everyone. I have woken up with purpose. Yeah, I don't know, I just feel really really nice today. Today's video is going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas. I have a few videos that I want to do before like I wrap up 2019 even though it is 2020. I have not finished with 2019. So, so yeah this is my what I got for Christmas video. The next couple of 2019 related videos that I have to do are my December favorites so I can finally finish doing favorites videos and I've been collecting bloopers for 2019, so I'm going to do that too. And then I can move on and start doing content I want to make this year. I don't have many ideas, but, you know. I'm also going to be doing TikTok compilations of, like, my TikToks based on themes over on my extras channel. So if you're, like, even vaguely interested in that, feel free to subscribe. I don't think I have that channel down below, but you can find it if you click on this channel yes hopefully that makes sense so yeah i'm gonna have a lgbt tiktok compilation a health and disability tiktok compilation and then whatever else i don't know but yeah let us just jump into this video so this is an exciting video not just because i get to show you guys everything that i got for Christmas. It is also the first time that I have gotten everything on my list. Granted, I only had five things on there, but I got every single thing. Okay, so the first thing from my list is Play-Doh. Now I got some scented Play-Doh from my stepmom. Once again, I use Play-Doh as like a fidget thingy so that I don't pick at my skin as often as I do. I have not opened it yet because Ollie is a thief. <laughs> he just steals shit. So I haven't opened it yet because I don't want him to steal it. But the fact that it's scented and the fact that I'm tearing my fingers apart really makes me want to open it. So I was super happy that I got this. The next thing I got also from my stepmom and my other siblings is a warehouse voucher. She got me one that was $50. I have not spent it yet. I went in looking for a couple of specific things that they didn't have because it's just been boxing day so like there was whole rows of shit missing. And then also just to browse a photo frame. Now I got this photo frame. There we go. You can kind of see the photos in it. This photo frame from my cousin. We do a cousin draw every year. I think I said that last year last year the year before whatever year i did my what i got for christmas 2018 and this year i got my cousin willa and so she well her mum got me a photo frame and i had enough photos to fill most of it but ended up having to print more because i was missing one and also i don't have many photos of my siblings on my dad's side so i printed off some of those and i'm going to be using my warehouse voucher to get another photo frame yes the next thing i got I cried about <laughs> and it's my very first <sighs> pride flag and I got it from my mommy <laughs> and I cried I cried because I'm a little bitch no um, I cried because I like it when people like actively support and accept me like not that I think anyone in my family doesn't but like you know you know? Right, and the last thing from my list that I got, once again from my stepmom and my other siblings, is a nice fake plant that I can hang from my roof and have greenery without killing it. So yeah, for the first time ever, I got everything on my list. Now for the other stuff. That was not everything my stepmom and children got me. I also got 
a card from the kids. They call me Mamu. Like, I'm sure you've probably heard Ollie call me Mumu sometimes. Finn and Poppy call me Mamu. And so they spell it like Mum. Moo. I got some. Actually, even though this is all from different people, I might do it all together. I got some washing stuff. So I got body wash slash shaving mousse and an exfoliating scrub. Actually, I could have used some of this today. Maybe. This one's from my stepmom and the children. Some more exfoliating body wash. This one is also from my stepmom and the children. And then some hand wash, which was from Ollie. Technically. And then the last thing I got from my stepmom and the kids is this crystal necklace. It's just a clear quartz. I don't know how well you can see that. But yeah, there we go. It's just a nice little clear quartz that I can wear. From my mum, I will, I'll do that. Got this. I got a big ass electric blanket. So I have an electric blanket on at the moment. Except I, oh, I don't know if it's like a single one or if it's just broken on one side. It's not great. <laughs> and while it doesn't matter that whether or not it's like double sided, cause I, I don't have anyone to share a bed with. It is only me and like a cat if I leave my door open. <laughs> However, the good thing about this one is like, it's a fitted electric blanket, so it's just like another fitted sheet. And I don't have to worry about it coming loose and moving around and just being irritating. So yeah, I got one, Ethan got one. It's good. Mum got us four things each, well, Ethan technically got five because one of his presents broke. But for the most part, we got four each. Ollie got a few more because he's the baby. My four were this, the electric blanket. Oh, these. My bracelets, which are rainbow. These are children's bracelets because I am the size of a child. <laughs> if you guys notice, I don't really do bracelets very much. I tend to just wear my hair ties, but it's not because I don't like them. It's because they don't fit me. <laughs> I don't do bracelets and I don't do chokers solely because they don't fit. However, Mum got me these from the children's section. I was actually there when she bought these. I was like looking at them, so she grabbed them to give me for Christmas. Where did I put it? Oh. And also these, we have this little pink choker from the children's section. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be wearing this one, but only cause there's like a little sticky bit from where it didn't quite sit on the ribbon properly. Um, it's cute though. And then this one, which is definitely, definitely my style. It's just one of the clear 90s ones with like love on it. Finally, from mum, I got this. It's a cushion cover and she thought, she had like a thought process behind it. She thought that while I was making it, filling it with cotton and stuff, I could turn it into like a spell pillow and like put like herbs and like my intentions and like all that in there so yeah I will have to have a think about what I can do could potentially turn it into a video because I haven't done any witchy videos in a while but we will see so that's the last thing from mum I got this also from Ollie now we also do a sibling draw and I got um Ethan got me this year. However, Ollie's dad also felt the need to buy presents for us from Ollie, so technically they both got me in a way. I don't know. But yeah, this also came from Ollie. It's a um, scent diffuser from Ethan and his girlfriend. I got this. If you can't tell what it is, it's like a um, it's like a just add tequila cocktail thing so it's got all like the ingredients on the bottom there and you literally just have to fill it up with tequila and let it sit for 24 hours I think and then yeah just use the strainer put it into shot glasses or whatever other beverage you might want and yeah nanny got this here we go I'm way less organized than I was last year I had it like in um segments of like clothes and like makeup and like blah 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 but most of my gifts were miscellaneous this year, so it's not in sections. 
I am attempting to keep it as like from people, but really I'm just grabbing whatever's closest. From Nanny, I got this Hogwarts alumni nightie. Now it is technically a nightie, however I do plan to also wear it as a dress because <laughs> it's cute and I don't have many dresses. And lastly, last but not least, my Nana and Papa. Now they got me a bunch of stuff. My Nana made this bag. I think I'm gonna switch it inside out because I like the stars. But yeah, she got me a few things. Most of, no, not most. Some of my stuff was the same as Poppy's because that's just what you do with siblings. You get them like the same stuff because it's cheap and it makes sense. But I got these little face cloth flannel things. Now, my Nana has been doing this thing for the last couple of years where she gets me homeware type items, except the thing about them is they raise money for Starship Hospital, which if you guys do not know, was my home for a while. No, that's not true. I mostly lived in the hospital here, but I spent a lot of time there. I am a sick kid. Yeah, if you are new here, I was a sick kid forever but the first few years of my life I lived in hospital mostly stayed in the one in my hometown but also would fly to Starship a lot I think I went to Wellington a few times I don't know I don't know I don't like to live in that particular part of my past so I just go off of what I'm told but yeah I was in Starship for a, a long time and so my Nana likes to donate whenever she can and so she started doing this thing where she buys these things that raise money for Starship and gives them to me for Christmas. I don't like have any like particular connection to Starship but like I understand that it is a place that means a lot to my family um, because it's a place that saved my life several times. Um, I'm grateful but like I don't remember it so I can't have any like personal vibe with it. She also got me, I'm pretty sure she made this box. My Nana is very crafty but in it there is soap. Poppy got a pink soap. I got a white soap that smells like soap. <laughs> I got some candles which smell like sandalwood. I got some bubbles. Again, Finn and Poppy got some bubbles too. Some cute little candle holders with some candles in them already. My Nana got me a candle last year too. If you guys remember, it was the one that I'm supposed to light every time I miss my dad. However, these ones are just candles. And then that's it. I also got a whole bunch of chocolate, which unfortunately I'm on a diet now, so I can only eat on Sundays, which is my cheat day. However, as the clock counted down to midnight last night, I did make a sizable dent <laughs> in my chocolate collection. Cause I'm like, you know what, fuck it. I'm going on a diet tomorrow. I'm gonna eat as much chocolate as I possibly can today. So I did that. Yeah, I don't think I'm forgetting anything. If I am, Oh well. <laughs> I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, let me know by giving me a thumbs up. Comment down below what you got for Christmas. Let me know. I want to hear it. Subscribe if you want. Tap the bell notification thingy to be notified every time I post. Stream Legacy. I would like it to get to a thousand streams before my birthday which is in April, so y'all have four months to do that. It's currently sitting on like 288, I think. So I reckon like a thousand before my birthday is like pretty decent. Like y'all can do it, I think, probably. I'm working on new music, so hopefully you guys can stop listening to the same five songs. <laughs> See you next time. Bye.